Hi guys, welcome back to Too Cool for Middle School. Welcome to Jensen's little area of the apartment. I took it over today to do a little bit of a style haul. I wanted to show you some of the pieces that I'll be wearing this summer and talk about some of the brands that I like to shop from. I'm always looking for brands that are eco-friendly, ethically made, that support women, that support small businesses, and have some kind of a bigger platform than just themselves and just fashion. And I get a lot of questions about where I shop. It's been almost two years now that I've really been focusing on trying to buy ethically made clothes. So it's taken a long time for me to kind of build up pieces and know what kind of brands I like and familiarize myself with that world. So it's a slow process, but I'll show you some of the things that I have been collecting lately for this summer. Some of you are already on summer break. I've got about two weeks left, and so these are the things that I will be living in this summer. Let's actually start with some jewelry. Um, I recently got these earrings from Seiko. I think that they are so pretty. I'll come a little closer so you can see. Um, the color is quail. It's kind of like a lavender purple, and then they're like dipped in gold at the bottom. So I think these are so beautiful. And then I'm also wearing this bracelet. I've been wearing this every day lately. This is from the Starfish Project. I really love what both of these companies are doing, plus they just make beautiful jewelry that I love to wear every day. So I will link every company that I talk about down below so that you'll have like a nice little set of resources for looking for ethically made clothes and shoes and jewelry. I have two pairs of shoes that I recently got I just wanted to share with you. I finally broke down and got some Rothy's. You guys, so many people have told me that I should try Rothy's. These are made out of recycled water bottles and I have some leggings made out of recycled water bottles from Girlfriend and I absolutely love those. I'm like obsessed with them. So everybody's always like, you should try Rothy's. They're sustainably made and people know I love flats and so I was like, all right, fine. I don't know why it took me so long, but these are so dang comfortable. They're so comfortable. I got them in navy and I got the rounded toe. They also come in like a loafer style and then more of like a pointy toe. But these ones have just been so perfect for me. I've been wearing them to school and they're perfect for work. I can last all day on my feet in these. They go with almost everything I own. I think they look professional. For a teacher, I think these are like the perfect flats. So comfortable and so cute, and they are expensive, so I can help you out a little bit with that. I have a $20 off code that I will link below, and that does help a little bit. I used somebody else's code when I bought my first ones, and I'm so glad that I did because these have been so worth it, and you can throw them in the washing machine. You just take out this little insert part, and you can wash them on gentle to keep them looking good. The other shoes that I got for summer are just these sandals from Steve Madden. Steve Madden is not a fair trade company or particularly ethical as far as I know, but I had been looking for these exact sandals. I actually tried to buy a pair from an ethical company and they just, they didn't fit right, they didn't look right. I wanted something that looked exactly like this. I just wanted very plain brown sandals with a simple strap that had a buckle so they would stay on my feet these are shoes that I can wear all summer long. I can wear forever. I don't really see these like going out of style. They don't really have that much of a style. They're just very basic, which is exactly what I was looking for. So I decided to buy these because they're something that I will wear all the time and it's not going to be like a wasteful purchase. I thought long and hard before I bought these, but I love them and I'm not wearing shoes right now, but I'm gonna change into these. <laughs> as soon as I'm done with this video, I'm gonna wear these all summer. Okay, so let's get into some of the clothing now. I'm gonna start with swimsuits, actually. Okay, so I just got this one in the mail this morning. I ordered this from Target, and Target is not a place that I like to shop for clothing, but I really needed to just try and find a black swimsuit. I am a mom, I'm 31, I'm not about that like G-string, bikini life. I wanted to try a one piece. I don't even have any one piece swimsuits, but I think this one is so pretty. It has like the scalloped edges at the top and then it even has them on the booty. I don't know if you can see that detail there, but this is just really, really cute. I wasn't sure if I wanted to keep it, but my husband really liked it actually. And I just wanted to have a one piece black swimsuit that I could wear if I take Jensen to swimming lessons or if we go to a pool or a hotel or a beach or whatever. So I still haven't 100% decided if I'm keeping it. I still have the tag on, but I think this would be a good purchase for me to just have for years to come, just to have a black swimsuit. 
I have an ethical option as well though. I got this tankini. Um, I actually ordered some bottoms that haven't come yet. But this is by a brand I recently heard of called Lime Ricky. And they make their swimsuits in the United States. And for the most part, they're like quite modest. So I really liked that about shopping on their website. This one is just really cute. I love the print. They're really stylish. That's the thing sometimes. It's like those modest swimsuits are kind of like, eh? But this one is so comfortable. Like I could just put this on. It's nice and high. It is very like flattering and sort of camouflaging in the tummy area. And it's just so easy to wear. So I just need to get some like high-waisted bottoms that I can put with this. And this I think will be like my main swimsuit, especially if I'm like chasing around a toddler. So I love this. Hi. Okay. Ugh. Jensen decided to make an appearance. Can you say hi? Hi. <laughs> oh, oh, look at me. Huh? Hi. <gasps> That's you. That's you. Yeah, you're a natural. What's daddy doing? Can you go find him? Where's daddy? I'm really always on borrowed time whenever I make a video. <laughs> One company that I've really loved shopping with just because I really like their aesthetic, I like kind of the overall idea of their brand and I love their clothes is Carly Jean Los Angeles and you can order from them online and they kind of have this like capsule wardrobe vibe where you can buy some of their pieces and just mix and match them and they do a lot of basics and most of them are made in LA so I really like that about them. I have several of their pieces that I showed in like my favorites videos from so far this year so you can check out a few of their pieces there. I also bought some jeans from them. I haven't bought jeans in a really long time. It's really difficult to find ethically made jeans. I tried some from Everlane that I didn't love. I just like very very skinny jeans. That's just my thing. I only really like skinny jeans. So these are from Carly Jean Los Angeles but they are not made in the United States. They do outsource some of their pieces but I really do love these I love just like a dark wash skinny jean they've got a little bit of distressing they're so comfortable I got these in a size 7 and they fit perfectly there's quite a bit of stretch to them and they were just something that I needed to kind of fill in my wardrobe and I've worn them a ton I have to resist the urge to wear them every single day <laughs> this next piece I'm so excited about I absolutely love these these are by Sudara and they're called Punjamis. So they have all of these Indian inspired patterns on all of their pieces and they are made in India. So this says made from hope, made for comfort, made proudly in India. So these are supposed to be pajamas but they are just so beautiful. I would totally wear these in the summertime. I've tried them on with some of my basic tank tops from Carly Jean and they just look so cute. I love the colors. I love the pattern. I love the elephants on here. And they actually just like look really cool. Like they fit really well. I got these in a size small and these are the capri length. So I don't know that I would wear these like to work very often, but I can't wait to just live in these all summer. So these will definitely be showing up on my Instagram feed quite a bit. I love finding fair trade companies like Sudara. They also do leggings. So I got this pair of black leggings. They just did like this huge sale. I think they were like $50 off. And these are fantastic quality leggings. They're super comfortable. I wore them the other day with a dress. So what I like about these is that you can wear these to work out, but they're not so athletic looking that you can't wear them like with other clothes. I wore these under kind of like a tunicky dress thing and I thought they were so cute. They're a capri length, but on me that means all the way to my ankles, but they fit really well. So comfortable, they really like hold you in. Fair trade, well made, and they were like super cheap, so there's nothing about these I don't like. <laughs> and who doesn't need black leggings? I always wear black leggings. I don't really like any patterns or anything on my leggings. I just love black ones. So anyway, the next piece, getting into some shirts here, this one is from Carly Jean. And this again is one of their few pieces that is imported. I just thought it was so beautiful. Look at these sleeves. Look at this detail. This is gorgeous. So 
Um, it's kind of like a boxier top, but then it has these really feminine details on the sleeves. So I can't wait to wear this one. I actually haven't worn it yet, but I think it would be perfect over the summer. If you have like a baby shower or a bridal shower or anything like that to go to, this would be so perfect. Really cute with jeans or other pants. I really want to wear this with just like some jeans and then I have these kind of teal flats that I think this would look so nice with. This would look great with like turquoise jewelry. Pretty obsessed. This is another basic from Carly Jean, and you can tell that I like basics, but then they just have like a little bit of a twist. So I love that this top has just a little ruffle right here. And this is actually one of our school colors. So this is perfect for me for like spirit days. <laughs> Jensen's down there pulling my arm. But it doesn't look so like school spirity, you know? Okay. <sighs> You want to be my cameraman? Hmm? Okay, another shirt that is kind of similar is this one. I posted this on Instagram the other day. Literally, if my classroom were a shirt, it would be this. <laughs> this is from One Loved Babe. It is made in the US. I love this shade of like light pink, and then it has these little tassel details on the sleeves. Like, how cute is that it's nice and long i love my skinny jeans and then kind of like long looser fitting shirts so this is just perfect like this is maybe my favorite shirt right now <laughs> this is another one i have to like hold myself back from wearing every single day i also wanted to show you this one from elegant tees they were kind enough to send this one to me i talk about them all the time and promote their products on Instagram just because I love them. I love what they're doing. I love that they employ women who are at risk of being trafficked and they're doing a lot of good in Nepal and providing work for communities that are vulnerable. So I love to purchase from them whenever I can. So this is a really cute organic cotton dress. I love when things are made from organic cotton so much better for the environment and the people who work with the cotton. The seam right here is really pretty. I love like the v-neck. I actually wear it with a little camisole underneath just to raise, you know, the level right here for teaching. Um, it's a really cute length. It's so comfortable and it's just a great neutral dress to have in your wardrobe. When I placed that order from Elegant Tees, I actually bought this dress and I loved the stripes. I'm a sucker for stripes. I really like this color. I thought this was just so perfect for like spring and summer it's really comfortable again the length is really nice i'm short so you know things are usually fairly long on me so that's kind of nice but another cool thing about this one is that the waistline is at sort of like an interesting place it's not like an empire waist and it's not really a drop waist but it's kind of in between and i think it's really flattering and looks sort of different. I'll be getting a lot of use out of this one as well. Oh, another thing that was so cute about this, and I have a boy, so this didn't apply to me, but you can buy this in little girl sizes and you can match your daughter. I was like, oh, that would be so cute. So they were doing like a sale for Mother's Day where you could buy one, your little girl could have one, you guys could match. So if you're lucky enough to have girls, this would be a really cute idea. Next time around, I'm crossing my fingers for a girl. So lately I've also been really into just like kind of like kimonos and like drapey cardigan type things. So this kimono was sent to me by this company called Piranda and they are based in Romania, which got me really excited because I've done missions trips to Romania before. And if you study the history of Romania and their communist dictator and um, the outlaw of birth control, it led to a situation where there were a lot of orphans and those orphans have now come of age and a lot of the girls are really, really at risk for being trafficked into sex slavery. So I'm definitely passionate about um, any organizations that serve the people of Romania. So these are handmade, ethically made in Romania. And this is like their classic piece. I think they actually call it like a Romano rather than a kimono. And their prices are great. I know that a lot of ethically made fair trade fashion can be pricey, but these really are not that pricey. <laughs> I love the fringe at the bottom and I just think that it's nice when you have a pretty basic wardrobe like I do of just a lot of plain jeans, plain shirts, and then you can put something like this over it and it really changes up your whole outfit. My neighbors are from Romania, I just remembered, so I should I should get her one of these. I also got another kind of kimono type piece. This one is from Seiko, that's also where I got my earrings, and I think this one is just 
beautiful. It's really kind of large. <laughs> it's a it's one size fits all. So it's got a lot of fabric. Um, Seiko did this piece in collaboration with Jessica Ray. You might have seen her TED talk. She's this really young, cute fashion designer who does swimsuits and she kind of challenged the idea that they have to be super revealing in order to be cute. So this can definitely be used as a swim cover up. I actually um, tried it on like with this bathing suit and I thought this was actually just a really elegant look. I've tried a couple of times to order swimsuits from Jessica Ray, but her products are also ethically made in fair trade and it's just difficult to keep things in stock. So usually my size is out of stock. So that's why I haven't bought a swimsuit from her yet, but I do just really, really love this. I'll totally wear it as a beach cover up, but it's definitely something that I would just like wear to school as well. I think it's really pretty with like this light pink color underneath or with this yellow shade that kind of picks up on the yellow in the poppy. I think that's so pretty. Now I want to change. <laughs> or even just with white underneath. It also looks really, really gorgeous. I guess you could do something green maybe or even black that kind of picks up on the center of the poppies. So this is just so pretty. My tip for this would just be, since it is such a statement piece, to keep your shirt underneath really simple, just a solid color. I see a lot of people wear like teacher shirts with some kind of like a message, you know, on their shirt and then put a kimono over it, but I really feel like it looks better just to keep it simple. Okay, this is another one of my new favorite pieces, Made in LA by Carly Jean. This is just a spaghetti strap dress. It's double lined, so it's very comfortable. On me, again, it's pretty long. I love the top. I've been looking for a dress like this for a really long time. It's just very versatile that I could wear with almost anything over it. So to be honest, I still don't love the look of my stomach post baby in like a tighter dress like this, but I love wearing this underneath like a chambray shirt. And then I just have like this really cute kind of black skirt effect. So this is a perfect layering piece. Actually, why didn't I not think of this before? This would be adorable. Okay, this is perfect. Like this would be just the right piece to put over it and you know, kind of do what I'm looking for with, you know, taking away some of the emphasis from my waist. But it's nice and open at the top right here, which is more of what I like to show. Ooh, that is so pretty. Okay, I need an excuse to wear this. It actually looks quite dressed up. Like I guess you could wear this to the beach with some sandals, but then you could wear this with some heels and it would look pretty fancy. So again, I really love kind of having like a capsule wardrobe and being able to mix and match a lot of my things. And I'm really able to do that with a lot of the stuff that I've gotten lately. So here is the last piece. This is also from Carly Jean, also made in LA. And I love a good flowy maxi dress. This one has pockets. I love the pockets and I love that it's just like really swingy. These vertical stripes are really flattering and just make it kind of different. So they have this exact dress in several different colors and different stripe patterns and stuff. It's so comfortable. You feel like you're wearing pajamas, but it actually looks quite nice and put together when you're wearing it. Okay, so this is my summer wardrobe. These are the things that I'm gonna be mixing and matching and living in all summer long. Whenever I can, I like to make sure that I am supporting fair trade ethical companies. I'm really happy with this wardrobe. I love when I have just a few things that I'm excited to wear that I can wear all the time. So let me know in the comments down below some of your favorite places to shop for the summer. Thanks so much for watching guys. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. That's more of like where I show my outfit of the day almost every morning and I can tag a lot of the things that I'm wearing in pictures and you can just really easily um, get access to all of these different brands and just kind of get ideas for outfit inspiration So I love doing that over there But it also helps me out so much if you come over to my youtube channel and like and subscribe and share videos So thank you so much for all your support. I'll see you in my next video. Bye